two days ago, I set up Grafana, Prometheus, and Node Exporter on my home media server. And today, I'm getting rid of all of it. So why am I getting rid of it? Well, I love stats and dashboards, and I love being able to see every little metric available to me. I think it's great. However, it has negatively impacted the performance of my Raspberry Pi. I'm currently running a Raspberry Pi 4 with 8 gig of RAM. Since installing Grafana, Prometheus, and Node Exporter, my average CPU usage has gone from about 5-ish percent to up to 15 and even at times 20%. And same with my RAM, it's jumped from an average of 25% all the way up to 40. Which in itself is not a huge deal as there's a lot of spare capacity still left for it to use. However, I've noticed a massive slowdown in responsiveness when it comes to accessing all of my different services from my home media server. So because of that, we're going to uninstall everything. Now, thankfully, I used Docker to set this up. So I'm just going to quickly remote in. We're going to open up a shell terminal, go to our monitoring folder, and we're going to run this one command to tear it all down. Docker compose down. And because we created persistent volumes, we're going to give it the volumes flag, which will also remove the persistent data associated with these Docker containers. And that's all I had to do. If I refresh this page, it should not work anymore. So moving forward, no Grafana, Prometheus, or Node exporter on my home media server. I'm just going to use the inbuilt processing information that I can get on Home Assistant. I'm quite happy with these gauges and straight away I can see memories drop back down to 25% and CPU back to 5. So just a quick one today, I wanted to give you that update because in my previous video I showed you guys how to set all of this up, however it caused performance issues for me, so I wanted to let you know in case you were thinking of doing something similar on your own Raspberry Pi. As always, thank you guys so much for watching and I will catch you in the next one.